Uh, I just want to ask you a couple of questions. So first of all, you're very passionate about the topic of uh, First Nations and uh, I guess wellness and uh, where does that passion come from? Well, I, 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 I don't know if, uh, I, I think it probably comes from the fact that I'm of Italian background and I come from an Italian family where passion and a, is, is part of the DNA. And I have been so moved by the issues that I have dealt with in my legal world and in my non-legal world. So uh, it's easy to get passionate about the relationship with First Nations and Aboriginal people. In terms of where we go in the future, uh, you seem you're optimistic. Uh, yes, I am optimistic. Um, I think, you know, it's the old, is it the glass half full or half empty? I think it's half full because there have been some signs. There are signs among uh, First Nations leaders, among the Inuit, the Métis, uh, that are showing increased uh, commitment uh, on those leaders and on, the, and on those communities to try to do something about it. And I think. The more we learn about the uh, uh, unsatisfactory conditions, the more people want to do something about it. And I think people are. Uh, but it's a daunting task. It's no quick fix. There is no quick fix in this. But there is, uh, I think, evidence of, uh, of optimism. Um, on another topic, the Ring of Fire, uh, it seems that you've been involved in a number of Aboriginal issues and First Nations issues, uh, from the residential schools to the, 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 the jury composition and, and now the Ring of Fire. It seems that they've reached a roadblock. Is there, what way can we kickstart the process? How do we go forth with the Ring of Fire? Well, we are still having uh, discussions on it. I, I can't go into much yeah, detail. Right. It would be inappropriate and wrong for, for me to, to do so, but I don't know. Government remains, Ontario remains committed. Uh, the uh, First Nation leadership uh, and communities remain committed. And so things are still moving. They're still moving. Good stuff. I have to say that. And I guess your, one of your words that I really enjoy is patience. A absolutely. And I think that is part of uh, relationship building. Good stuff. And I guess in a sense, with a lot of the issues that you brought up today, what's the main takeaway that you're looking uh, for the uh, for the people that were here today? Well, I think the main takeaway is that we can all do our part. Every one of us uh, can make a difference. Uh, and I think that's what I would uh, have you convey. Sounds good. Thank, thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you.